hi guys welcome back to our channel please excuse if the quality isn't that great i am filming on my phone because i have no idea where my camera charger is and it is currently dead we've been using jess's camera just because i think my charger is still at my mum and dad's so i need to go and find that so i can actually use my camera but i thought i'd film a little haste update as i haven't filmed one in a while and we've done a few bits but nothing major but this week we are planning to do a little bit more so i think the last time i filmed a house update we had plastered the other two bedrooms and we're making a start on those we actually didn't make a start on those and they've just been stuck the way they are just plastered walls just because we unexpectedly needed to get a new boiler which was not great as we did pay for a whole power flush because we thought it was the pipes and then the boiler just broke on us so we had to fork out for that so as you can imagine that took most of our money which meant we had to just halt on the other two bedrooms but i have made a start to the bigger bedroom so last weekend i did a miss coat and then i'm going to start the miss coat on the second bedroom today I was going to do the ceiling first in the other bedroom before I moved on to the little bedroom. But I thought if I just miscut them all first, then at least I can do the ceilings all in one go, which will be a lot easier because I hate, I hate painting the ceilings. It's the worst. Aaron normally paints like the first miscut on the ceiling and the first normal coat of emulsion. And then I do the last one. But he has been working quite a lot recently. Um, so while he's been at work on the weekend, I've just been painting just so it's done. And obviously I haven't really got anything else to do. So that's what I've been doing. But I'll give you an update on like the rest of the house. So before we go downstairs, we have now got one bit of a wardrobe. Ignore all the rest of the mess in here. Honestly, it's ridiculous. Um, so my dad's just done the like the inside of this part of the wardrobe obviously in these doors and rails and everything and then he's currently making the rest for along this wall it is going to be a bit of a squeeze just because our bedroom is quite long like lengthways lengthways widthways um but the length isn't as long as the second bedroom um obviously i haven't done anything there so this is the second bedroom which i did a miss coat on last week to be fair it's for a miss coat it's not as patchy as it normally is um and the ceiling so yeah once i've got the paint samples for this one i'll make a start on the painting i was going to use the paint that we used downstairs the one that i changed but i don't think i want to use it because it's just a bit too pink i think i want a bit more neutral so that's the plan for this room and then i'm not sure if you remember what this back room looked like but if i've got a photo I'll, I'll pop it here um but we actually weren't planning to do anything to this room other than just add a dining table um but someone actually had a sofa that they were giving away for free so we thought if we just spruce it up a bit paint the walls so i painted the walls egyptian cotton um so it's kind of like a grayish color which goes with obviously the sofa i painted the side the tiles here white and the side white and then we have just got a table obviously it is open at the minute but normally it's just flat and put away um, but it's a really nice room just to sit in i normally work in this room because it's really warm in the day when the sun's out ignore the start of the garden that's something we're going to get to this week but yeah we just thought we spruce it up obviously we're not doing anything major in here just because obviously when we do plan to extend this room will obviously extend as well it won't extend but it will have like the extension on it so there's not really any point in doing anything in here because we'll do it all in one go so that's the plan so we're just giving it a bit of a spruce up for now but yeah that's all we've really done in the last few weeks other than our new boiler but i'm just going to get changed into my painting clothes now and I'm going to make a start on the mist coat in the little bedroom.
I'm not as bad as I was last week. Last week I was literally covered in paint. I'm not too bad. I've got a few bits. My hands are obviously covered and my ankles are covered, but it is done. It didn't take me as long to do as it did obviously the big bedroom that was long, but this wasn't too bad and I just had enough paint. I've literally just run out of paint, so we're gonna have to get some more water emulsion for the ceilings. But I'll show you. Here is the walls all painted. Obviously it's streaky. I've just done this wall. This is a wall which you can tell that I've been running out of paint, but it is only the mist coat, so it doesn't really matter anyway. And then the color will go on top of this. I'm not really sure what color, probably a neutral color, because this will probably end up being like a nursery if we have a baby. Um, so I'm thinking to just keep it neutral. We'll see. I think I want a panel here as well. I'm not sure. I don't know, I haven't decided yet, but I do think it would look nice because there's gonna be a wardrobe on our top of here. <gasps> I've just realized I haven't miscoated the bottom. Oh my life. Let me see if I can get that last bit of paint and do that. Right, I've painted it. It hasn't gone on very well for some reason. I've had to brush this side. It's just not really taking well to the plaster, but I'm sure it'll be fine once obviously I put the actual paint on. But I'm gonna go and have a shower now. But annoyed as I wash my hair and I've got paint in my hair, so that's not the greatest. But I'm gonna tidy everything up, jump in the shower. Our landing is currently full of dust from where I've walked, so I had footprints into it because these things are so dusty from the plaster. So I'll probably, to be fair, I'll probably sweep these up before I actually paint the walls the colour that it's gonna be. And then, yeah, I'm just gonna chill for the evening after that. It's now Bank Holiday Monday. I just chilled last night, so I didn't really film. But today we were actually planning on sorting the garden out. But the weather has had other plans, which is really annoying. It's really wet and horrible weather. I can't believe how awful it's been this April. Normally we have at least a few hot days, but we haven't had any of that. So it's a bit rubbish. So I think I was going to sort out the garage and clean that all out and then get everything ready to hopefully clean the gutter in tomorrow. And then he wants to cut the grass and jet wash all the slabs because they're all really dirty. But we think if also we give it a good jet wash, it should bring it up really nice. And we've bought a garden set from Aldi, which we want to set up as well before my birthday on the weekend. So hopefully we can get all that done this week and I can film it because um, that was the plan so we'll see but yeah we're just gonna go and do the food shop now because we didn't do that yesterday we're gonna pop to Aldi and then Asda to get like the branded bits like the cheese and stuff because we've run out of that so we're gonna pop there we normally pop to Sainsbury's because it's closer if we need to get anything else that's not in Aldi but more things are in offer in Asda at the minute so we'll travel a little bit further just to get those things that are in offer because you know all about saving the dollar we are back and it's probably the most we've actually ever spent on the shopping. I don't even know how we spent this much to be fair, but we are now going to have a fully stacked fridge. Woo! We've also bought some wraps. Where they are they? I don't even know where they are. Oh, we bought these wraps to have for lunch today. Never had them before and we thought we'd treat ourselves being as though it's been cold on Monday. Aaron's dropped the today. I'm leaving him to it. I did ask him if he wanted some help, but uh, he said he likes to do it by himself, so I'm just gonna leave him to it. But this is our garage. This door needs to go back on here, um, which we want my dad to do because it just needs to stand down because we put some um, liner. Is it liner? Is that what it's called? Liner? Yeah. Liner down in the utility just to make it a bit cleaner so now the door won't actually go back on. These are our doors for the rest of the house that someone gave us for free. We just haven't put them on yet because we're obviously doing the rooms and everything else that we've just chucked in here. Bricks when we do the extension. I don't know why we started collecting them because it's going to be a while until we need those. Anyway, I'm going to leave him to it and I'm going to go and put some washing gate while Aaron's work clothes uh, just before Lou comes to get me.
Tuesday. I've just finished work. It's just after five o'clock. Tuesdays are my late days when I'll finish till five. I've prepped all the tea, got it all ready to cook, and now I'm going to go and help Aaron clear the gutter. Um, basically, I'm just footing the ladder. He's doing all the hard work. So, while the tea's cooking, we're going to be doing that, get the garden sorted. So, today's clearing the gutter in and getting all the stuff off the uh, patio and ready for it to be jet washed. And then tomorrow's going to be mowing the lawn, jet washing, as long as the weather is half decent. So, yeah, I'm just going to go and help Alan do that. This is how far we've got to. Obviously I've jet washed. As you can see, it's not perfect at the minute. We do need to go over it again. Um, it's the next day actually, since we jet washed yesterday because we've got massive puddles everywhere because I don't know if you can see, but it's quite slanted. Um, and there's parts all across here that are like that. So it was just full of puddles and we couldn't clean it up yesterday. So we let it dry and then I've just swept it into piles. As you can see over here, which I'm going to have to scoop up in a minute, but I'm trying to find a dustbin and brush. The difference, you can already see. So that's a path. We haven't done the path yet, but you can just see the difference in the two. But we do need to go over it again because it's not perfect, but it's better than it was anyway. So guys, I'm going to go ahead and end the video there. Ignore me with the question. I am freezing. So I'm going to go and get my pyjamas on a minute and my dressing gown and snuggle up and watch TV for the evening. But we were going to set up the garden furniture, but the weather's had other plans. And to be honest, we haven't got a cover yet anyway. So we don't want to set it up and then not be able to cover it and then the rain just ruin it. Because honestly, the weather at the minute is horrible. Considering it's May, it is awful. It's cold, it's raining constantly. I'm going away at the end of May in England, my well, in Wales. So I'm hoping the weather gets better but i hope you enjoyed this little video anyway just to catch up of what we've been getting up to if you do want to see any more updates i have made an instagram called the fellows home so if you want to go and have a cheeky little look and a cheeky little follow that'd be great i have got the same um handle on tiktok as well so i'm, I'm on both instagram and tiktok anyone wants to go and see but i hope you like this video anyway and me and jess will see you in our next one bye